So I am going to do my review for my Raven R29 bow that I, uh, crossbow that I bought this year. So this is my crossbow and I am done with my 20, 2021 hunting season with it. And I have to say that it was successful. I've got a nine point and uh, it was an awesome hunt. And it was a 43 yard shot that I took this uh, deer with. I used a um, Grim Reaper Hades uh, tip and it was extremely well done. Uh, the deer went 80 yards, quick clean kill, and I have to say my Raven, or my Raven crossbow was amazing all the way through from the lighting to the shot to I mean everything it has been really good. I do have a couple of critiques but they're small critiques. I have to say that the, the Raven bolt crossbow is so accurate it's unbelievable. 20 to 50 yards amazing and I didn't shoot any beyond 50 yards but I imagine it's quite well from what I understand. But I mean you're talking uh, you have to shoot different bullseyes with your arrows or you're going to double your arrows. It's that accurate. Once you sight it in at 50 and then go back and double check at 20, it's amazing from then on. And I had really, really good luck with it. Um, so let's get into what are the issues that I had. So the issues I had was uh, basically have to do with the quiver. As you can see, the quiver comes really close to your hands. So if you don't have the quiver off the boat, it's extremely hard to use. And um, it does not like to keep the arrows. I lost an arrow when I was hunting on the way in because in, there's no cups in the end of the quiver. So uh, it gets bumped and it falls out just like that. So I'm not a fan of the quiver. The other thing I'm not a fan of with arrows, the lighted knock. Okay, I got the lighted knock to stay off stayed off all night I'm out hunting again and it's back on again so and you can see it's on right now right by bang it around it'll go off uh, shake it move it do all the things that you see on the internet and it just keeps coming back on so that is one of my negatives on this boat crossbow is that lighted knocks so the other thing is um, during the heat of uh, having the um, deer come in having to range it and, and uh, such, the, um, the safety is in a location that uh, you have to, to be able to see it and do it because you're in like this and you're looking at what, you, what you're shooting at, you gotta bring it all the way back out, click it, and then come back into it and not lose where your deer's at or anything else. So I'm not a real fan of the location of safety. However, I get why it's there, but that being said, um, those are very, very minute uh, negatives that I have on this crossbow. The positive, the speed, I shot at 43 yards, and this was a straight there. You could not see any arc in the arrow. I mean, I could see the see the bolt go right, excuse me, the bolt. The, this is my first time with crossbow, so I'm not used to the whole arrow bolt thing. But anyways, uh, from, from crossbow to deer, uh, straight shot and I could watch it go right through the deer. And you know, you, you just can't believe what a great first kill, quick kill, uh, lethal combination this is. Now, there is one, one more thing is, I bought the R29 and it's fantastic. It does have one drawback and that's the clicking sound when it's cocking, everybody knows about it. Uh, my brother bought the R29X, which is silent. I think if I had to do it over again, I would have paid the extra couple hundred bucks or, or whatever it is to get the R29X. But the R29, once it's cocked and locked, ready to go, is an amazing unit. So I would have to give this a thumbs up and I would buy this crossbow again and I recommend it to my friends. So if you want a crossbow that's lethal and it's going to last you a long time, Raven.